Hey, Shalom. So, like, you guys got shit for an attention span, so we'll make it simple. Um, when you hear about the mark of the beast and accepting the mark of the beast and uh, having your head cut off and that kind of thing, um, you got to realize that God is in two parts, two pillars, a blessing and a curse. Uh, for some reason, we forgot about the curse part, and the deal is, uh, if you will not accept that simple stuff from the book of Job 2.10, that God sends good and evil, well then guess what? You're basically cutting your head off uh, in that you don't understand God. The mark of the beast is fear. It marks your mind. And it causes your hands to do whatever they do. Can it become a physical monarch? Sure. Simple as that. Hey, shalom.